Earlier this morning, the deer was deformed, and now, perchance, these tired women and this boy, their clothes stained with blood. So sometimes you have to make a choice that you might not be ready to make. You know, buy that cute pair of heels at the mall and be out of money for lunch for the week, or get the chocolate ice cream and risk getting it all over your new shirt. That's me, by the way, Gemma, and I'm 19 years old. Jim, you mind telling me what's interesting behind your desk? Oh, nothing. I just dropped my pencil. Actually, could I run the bathroom real quick? Make it quick. My father, Ponzio, currently runs the Mafia here in Chicago. Since my brother's death last year, my father has been preparing me to take over the business. However, he wants to test me. You know, make sure I've got the balls for this kind of thing. The O'Malley kid's office. All right, I'll take care of it. Jim, are you sure you can do this? You know what happens if you screw up, right? Dad, I know. I'm ready, I swear. I can do this. These mix need to know this is our territory. There is no messing around here. Do you understand me? Yeah. Don't you think we might be taking things a little too far here? She needs to understand that family comes first. This is the life she was born into. She has no choice. Don't make her get mixed up in this. She's scared stiff and you know it. Vincenzo, listen. I have to know that she's ready in case something happens to me. This kid needs to be taken care of and she is the closest one to him. Look, I'm giving her an opportunity here. She can end it right now and get into business for life. But if she fails, we're gonna have to take matters into our own. And that's where you come in. But she's my niece, your daughter. I, I just do can't do this. job. Well, you're gonna be right down there with them. Now get the fuck out! Jim, what are you doing here? Oh, I finally got the money that we talked about. We, we can finally get the hell out of here. We are south. No, listen to me. We can't. It won't work. No, come on. We can... Jim, what the hell are you doing with a gun? My father found out you were dealing for the Malones. I did this for us. Well, I, I promised you I'd get you out of here. You don't have to be like your dad. I can't just leave. He'll find me. And you. He'll kill us both. We, we have a chance. We can just get in the car, and we just, we'll never be heard of again. It won't work. My family will find me. Though it won't, your parents won't have, your parents won't have a clue where we are. We can start over. We can start new lives. I'll protect you. Promise me this will work. Because if there's even the slightest chance that it won't, then I can't. I can't. It's too big of a risk. I promise that everything's gonna be okay. Because I love you. I love you too. Now come on, we have to go. What? She didn't do it. Then you know what you have to do. I got it. Stop off by Jason's and pick up the paperwork. He's got a birth certificate and socials for us. 
giving up passports in case we decide to leave the country. Oh shit. Just pull over, stay calm. They say that blood is thicker than water. Sometimes blood lets you down, but sometimes they're the only ones who can help you out. You never really know which ones to trust.